हेलो स्टूडेंट्स टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू स्टडी ह्यूमन सर्कुलेटरी सिस्टम फॉलोइंग फिफ्थ ग्रेड आईसीसी करिकुलम सो एज वी नो आवर बॉडी इज मेड अप ऑफ मेनी ऑर्गन सिस्टम्स सेल्स टुगेदर फॉर्म टिश्यू टिश्यू टुगेदर फॉर्म ऑर्गन्स एंड ऑर्गन्स टुगेदर फॉर्म ऑर्गन सिस्टम विच वर्क टुगेदर सो दैट आवर बॉडी कैन फंक्शन नॉर्मली You must have studied about various organ system in your previous class. Let us study more about circulatory system and its role in our body. So what is circulatory system? The circulatory system that helps to transport essential nutrients and oxygen inside our body. It consists of heart, blood and a network of blood vessels. The heart is a muscular pump that pumps blood into the blood vessels to reach all organs of the body. It also receives blood from all the organs of the body. The heart is as big as your fist. The pumping action of heart is called heartbeat. It is heard by doctor through a stethoscope. A healthy person heart beats 72 times a minute. can you feel your heart beat blood a normal human has 4 to 5 liter of blood blood is a red colored fluid that flows through blood vessels this blood helps to carry all the nutrients and oxygen to the body it also carry away waste materials from different parts of the body blood vessels these are thin tube like structure that start from the heart and run through the entire body forming a network these are of three types arteries veins and capillaries now let's see the difference between arteries and vein arteries are big and thick whereas veins are thinner than arteries Arteries carry oxygenated blood that is oxygen rich blood whereas veins carry blood full of carbon dioxide arteries carry blood from heart to all parts of the body veins carry blood from all parts of the body to heart some common examples of arteries are aorta axilla and common carotid some example of veins vena cava the largest vein pulmonary vein systemic vein etc capillaries they are thinnest blood vessels that connect arteries and veins and allow oxygen and food to pass into the body cell the tiny capillaries also pass on the waste again to vein our blood is made up of a watery fluid called plasma and billions of tiny blood cells the types of blood cells in our body are red blood cells white blood cells and platelets so blood has many functions in our body hemoglobin the protein inside red blood cells carries oxygen white blood cells are like soldiers and defend the body from invading germs platelets form protective clot to protect and heal our body when we cut our cells it is body's transport system carrying oxygen and nutrients to the body cell and taking away waste product like carbon dioxide blood also helps to keep our body at normal temperature Here the picture is showing how the components in blood look. I hope now you can answer this simple math the following. I hope you have liked this video. Thank you.